Welcome to Counting Back. In this lesson, I'm learning to count down to solve subtraction problems. Let's imagine I had 12 sweets and I ate three of them. Now I can record that like this. The 12 sweets I had minus the three sweets that, I, sweets that I ate leaves me with some amount of sweets. So to answer that, I can find 12 on my number line and then I need to count back three. One, two, three, or 11, 10, nine. So the answer to 12 minus three is nine. Let's try another question. Uh, this time I've got 15 sweets and I eat four of those sweets. So I can record that like this. 15 sweets minus the four sweets that I eat is going to leave me with some amount of sweets left over. So just like last time, I find 15 on my number line and I need to count back four. So I'll have 14, 13, 12 and 11. And let's just check that I did count back 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yes, I've counted back 4. So the answer to 15 minus 4 must be 11. Now let's try a question without the number line. Uh, this time I had 8 sweets and I ate 5. So I can record that like this. 8 sweets minus the five that I ate is going to leave me with some amount of sweets. So just like last time, I'm going to count back five from my eight. So I'll have seven, six, five, four, and three. And we can just check that I did count back five. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, so the answer to eight minus five is three. Let's try another one. Let's imagine there are 16 people on a bus and three people get off. I want to know how many people are left. So I can record that like this. 16 minus the three people who get off leaves me with the amount of people still on the bus. So just like before, I'm going to count backwards from 16 and I need to go back 3. So I'll have 15, 14, and 13. And just like the other, just like we did last time, let's just check that we did count back 3. Yep, I've got my three numbers here. So the answer to 16 minus 3 is 13. Let's try one last question with some slightly bigger numbers. Uh, let's imagine a tennis coach has got 82 tennis balls and unfortunately over the season he loses four of them. So I want to work out how many tennis balls does he have left. So I can uh, record that like this. 82 tennis balls minus the four that he lost leaves him with some amount of tennis balls. I want to work out what that amount is. So just like we've done in the other examples, I'm going to count backwards from 82 and I need to go back four numbers. So I'll have 81, 80, 79, and 78. And just like we did before, let's just check we've counted back four numbers. And you can see that we have here. So the answer to 82 minus 4 is 78. Well, I hope you found this lesson helpful. For more lessons, check out teachertools.co.nz.